Grammar 3 for Level 3 Students Unit 9 Models Part 1 Making Suggestions Let's Let's means let us. It is followed by the simple form of a verb and it is used for making a suggestion. Let's go for sightseeing. Let's watch a movie. In both the sentences, the subject is imperative and it is followed by the simple form of the verb. Let's not. It's also followed by the simple form of a verb. Let's not go for sightseeing. Let's not watch a movie. In both the sentences, the subjects are imperative and the verbs are in the simple present form. Making suggestions. Why don't? Why don't is used primarily in a spoken English to make a friendly suggestion. Why don't we go for sightseeing? The person is making a suggestion. It means, let's go for sightseeing. Why don't you go for a walk? It means, I suggest that you go for a walk. In both the sentences, the verbs are in the present simple form. Making suggestions. Shall I or we? Shall I or we is used in a question to make a suggestion. It means that the speaker is asking another person if he or she agrees with the suggestion. Shall we go for sightseeing? What do you suggest? Shall I bring a cup of coffee for you? Is that okay with you? The person is asking another person if he or she agrees with the suggestion. Could is also used to make a suggestion. It means that the speaker is asking another person if she or he agrees with the suggestion. Today is a holiday. We could go on a picnic. He needs help for English. He could talk to his teacher. In both the sentences, the verbs are in the present simple form. Making suggestions could have. Could have is used to offer hindsight possibilities. It means that the subject of the sentence understands and realizes about an event after it has happened. He did not understand at the time it happened. It was raining. We could have brought an umbrella. The subject of the sentence did not realize that it was going to rain. But when it started to rain, the subject realizes. He lost his bag. He could have informed the security. When it was lost, the subject could not or did not understand. But when it had happened, he could realize.